In the heart of Europe, a tranquil day in Prague was shattered when an unthinkable tragedy struck Charles University. Located in downtown Prague, Charles University has long been a beacon of learning, drawing in thousands of students from across the globe. Its philosophy department, usually a hub of intellectual discourse, became the site of a chilling incident that would send shockwaves through the city and beyond. On a day that had started like any other, an armed man opened fire within the hallowed walls of the university. The gunman, a student of the institution, targeted his peers in a horrific act of violence. The motive behind this horrendous act remains shrouded in mystery. The immediate aftermath was a scene of chaos and terror. As the university building echoed with the sound of gunfire, the area around it descended into pandemonium. The peaceful rhythm of Prague's historic center was replaced with the frantic beat of a city under threat. The tragedy claimed the lives of 15 individuals and left 24 others nursing injuries of varying severity. Each shot fired not only targeted the victims, but also tore through the fabric of a city renowned for its tranquility and architectural beauty. The local police force responded swiftly, their sirens piercing the air as they rushed to the scene. Their swift action ensured the perpetrator was neutralized, but their search was far from over. With the possibility of explosives left behind by the shooter, the police evacuated the philosophy department, their efforts casting a further shadow over the city. The ordinarily bustling squares of Prague's historic center were quickly sealed off, their cobblestones silent witnesses to the terror that had unfolded. Residents and tourists alike were left reeling, their day of normalcy replaced with a stark reminder of the fragility of peace. As the philosophy department was hastily evacuated, the city's historic center was plunged into a state of panic. A tranquil day had transformed into a nightmare. The unthinkable tragedy leaving a city, a nation, and the world in mourning. Behind this chilling act of violence was a student, a familiar face in the crowd, now the center of a horrifying incident. Amid the hallowed halls of Charles University, an institution steeped in history and knowledge, it was one of their own who shattered the tranquility of the academic haven. This individual, not an outsider but a student of the university, stepped into the philosophy department and unleashed a barrage of bullets that culminated in a scene of unspeakable horror. The student's identity remains shielded from public discourse, a conscious decision to avoid glorifying the perpetrator or encouraging copycat incidents. The authorities reported that the student was found lifeless at the scene, their life extinguished in the same flurry of violence they had unleashed upon others. The individual, once a part of the academic community, brought about a day of mourning that will forever be etched in the university's history. The city's response was swift, a testament to the resilience and strength of the Prague community. As chaos and fear gripped the city, law enforcement acted with decisive precision. The philosophy department building of Charles University, the scene of the tragedy, was promptly evacuated. Each room searched meticulously for possible explosives, leaving no stone unturned in the pursuit of safety. The affected area, a bustling hub near major tourist sites, was rapidly sealed off. A necessary measure to ensure the safety of both the residents and visitors alike. The police response was massive with officers flooding the city's historic center, a clear display of their unwavering commitment to protect their community. Public warnings were issued, advising people to stay indoors. A chilling reminder of the gravity of the situation, but also a testament to the city's readiness to communicate and act in the interest of public safety. In the face of fear and uncertainty the city of Prague rallied, standing strong in the face of adversity. In the aftermath of the shooting the city is left grappling with the horrifying reality of what transpired. A pall of sorrow hangs heavy over Prague as it mourns the loss of 15 souls, each one a bright thread in the rich tapestry of the city's life, abruptly severed. The echoes of gunshots have given way to the quiet tears of a community in mourning. Over two dozen people are nursing their wounds, both physical and emotional, a chilling reminder of the terror that unfolded. The philosophy department building of Charles University, once a thriving hub of academic discourse, now stands eerily silent, its hallways echoing with the haunting memory of the tragic incident. Investigations are underway as law enforcement agencies sift through the wreckage in search of clues. The aim? To piece together the puzzle of why a student turned his gun on his peers, to understand the motive behind this senseless act of violence. Meanwhile, the city's historic center, a popular tourist destination, wears a deserted look as the local populace and visitors alike come to terms with the tragedy. 
The people of Prague, resilient as they are, are slowly beginning to pick up the pieces, their spirit undeterred. Vigils are being held, stories of the victims are being shared, and the city is collectively finding solace in unity and shared grief. As the city mourns, the search for answers continues in hopes of making sense of this senseless act. The Prague shooting, a horrifying incident that has left a deep scar on the heart of the city. A day now etched in memory when an armed man opened fire in a university building tragically claiming the lives of 15 people. The motive, still a mystery. The impact, devastating. Yet amidst the chaos, the city of Prague has shown an incredible resilience. In the face of such a tragedy, the city's response was swift and decisive, a testament to the strength and preparedness of its emergency services. The philosophy department of Charles University was evacuated, the area sealed off, all necessary precautions taken to ensure safety. But beyond the immediate response, the city has shown its true character. In the midst of mourning, there is unity, a collective resolve to recover and rebuild. Such incidents shake us to our core, but they also remind us of the strength that lies within us, of our capacity for empathy, compassion, and solidarity. As Prague mourns, it also stands resilient, a testament to the indomitable spirit of its people, who will remember, recover, and above all, remain united.